We got another Quest 2 accessory. It's a carrying case and Yogi Bear is back. We've got our first customer. Let's see what the bear's been up to. Full speed ahead, boo -boo. Okay. So we got one carrying case for your Quest 2, but that's a USB port right there on the side. It looks like it's supposed to be like $44, but it's currently on sale for $37. Plus there's a $5 off coupon on Amazon. It shows it on the Amazon page with a big old halo strap in there. So you know I'm gonna test it first thing with that Bobo VR M2 Plus. Interestingly, remember that desk tech case? If you missed that video, I'll leave a link because it's really cool. The desk tech case has a 10,000 milliamp hour battery and it makes it cost $100. Well, this one has that USB port not because there's a battery in here or anything. This is just pass-through charging. Boy, I don't know about this case though. I'm gonna have to like adjust my halo strap just to get it in there. They show a big halo, but I'm gonna say it looks like it's a bit of a tight fit for a halo. I'm gonna really strap this thing down. It's not a terribly tight fit, it works, but it's it's closer than I'd like it to be, I guess. It's got a big old weird pouch in the top that you can throw stuff in that stays kind of soft when it goes on top of your Quest, which is nice. But to get your controllers in here, you'd have to probably go back to 69ing them. Shove them in this hole. Oh, just kidding. Stay. And then work your pack down. There's gotta be a battery laying around here somewhere. It does work with the battery still. Although if you have a battery strap, this isn't gonna really be that great for you because your only charging port is right here and the cable doesn't get long enough to run to the back to charge a battery. Boom, 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 shut off. You wanna plug the other end of this in for me? <laughs> this is for people who have a Quest 2, but when, as soon as you're done playing it, you like to put it in a case. You like to keep the dust off, you like to keep it safe, but now you don't have to worry about charging it and then putting it in the case. Ideally, you should be able to just put this in here and trust that it's charging. I guess they didn't decide any lights of any sort would be helpful, so let me take a peek. Oh, is this on switch on on the power strip? Yeah, no. <laughs> We're doing great. We're just winning. All right, we'll, we'll restart that section from the top. <laughs> I'm okay. So this is for the crowd that has a Quest 2, but the minute you're done playing, you don't want dust to collect. You don't want your little brother to come try and play Gorilla Tag and break it. You want your headset in a case, safe and on its own. But now you don't have to charge it anymore before you put it in that case. Well, you do come up with some good plans, Yogi. <laughs> So it's plugged in there. They didn't add any light indicators on the outside, which I would have liked. I guess I can take a peek and see if it's charging. It is charging. Pretty simple, really. This is just a USB-C extension from here to there that plugs right in. And at $32 right now on sale? I gotta say, Yogi, you've uh, outdone yourself. I can't think of any like Yogi things Yogi said that would have fit right there. Hey, boo boo, the case works. <laughs> <laughs> That's horrible. It's one of his inventions that actually works. <laughs> That's because I'm smarter than the average bear. It does its job and it fits everything in it. Some of you out there are probably gonna ask, well, can you fit bigger controller grips? Bigger controller grips, Kiwi Top version. We'll say it's a tight fit. It does fit. You can feel that it's in there. There's a little pressure, but it fits and it's charging. I mean, if you're not someone who needs a battery strap, I, I gotta say, I can't really knock this case for anything. The only other question, of course, well, I have a battery strap and I really like my battery strap. Can I charge my battery? I'm gonna say probably not. This is so short. Maybe if you had like one of those really flat battery packs. Hang on, hang on. I'm gonna strap you down, stay. Well, dang it, Yogi, I guess you did it. I'm so smart it hurts. And for a very low price, it works. It does everything it says. You go carry it around. A couple of things to think about. One, don't put this somewhere like this where you're not gonna think about just grab it and run across the room with this still plugged in because the way this is shaped in the side here, I mean, that's not gonna pull as you pull away. That's gonna mess that up. Two, kind of the same thing when you have your headset plugged in here. 
when you have your headset plugged in here and you're ready to play, pop your controllers out, you need to remember not to just grab this and run because same thing, this isn't really gonna wanna just pop out the way it's set. A magnetic charger here might've done it some justice, but it'd have to be a really strong one that would stay on. If this is in there and you try and yank it away, you're gonna possibly get yourself into the same kind of trouble. Keep those things in mind. I don't know what this hole is here for. Too small for a Bobo pack. Maybe Yogi has a battery pack that technically fits in there. What do you think out there? I'd love to hear in the comments. Do you think it makes sense to have something like this where you can charge it in the case now, especially those of you who charge it up and then put it in a case? I think it's actually a pretty neat idea. And the fact that it doesn't have a battery doesn't drive this thing up to a hundred bucks like that Desk Tech one. Although the Desk Tech one does look really cool. Thank you so much for coming out and being here today. And I'll see you in another reality. Hey, boo-boo. <laughs> Can't wait for the Yogi Bear memes in that one.